What's up, ladies and gents? This is Mech Plays Games back with some more Code Veronica. I'm actually going to turn this volume down just just a tad because I had it way up, and you guys are about to hear a mad echo if I don't turn it down. All right, so let's uh, get going from where we left off. We're going to try to head back the way uh, that Steve just went and try to get that handgun upgrade and some ammo. I think I think this elevator leads back down. Or you can go back down. B1F, please. Yes, please. Let's do this. Okay, what is this? Oh, there's hand... Okay, that... You couldn't even see that, but I'll take it. A relief of a weird looking face. Okay, this is like a staircase or something that hasn't been um, let down yet. So we're definitely not going that way. Um, this is my second time trying to record this because uh, the Elgato decided to crap out on me again. But I didn't make it any like any further really. I, I only walked like a step and, and while I was recording and then it freaking went out on me. So hopefully... This time it doesn't do that. Breaker may fail due to overload. I tried to change the USB um, slot just in case one of the ports was bad in my computer, but we'll see. In case of failure, raise the lever as illustrated. The ventilation of the device will resume operation. Hopefully, um, if there's if the problem consists, then I will uh, I'll have to buy a new Elgato, I guess, eventually. But hopefully, it does not. Because that would put a damper on thing or a hamper damper, one of those two things, on everything, on my plans. All right, so we got some grenade ammo here. Uh, the problem with taking this right now is that I don't have much room. So, okay, so this leads to that room with the handgun ammo and the upgrade. Okay, and this, whatever this is, secured with a simple lock. I think yellow is acid rounds. So that'd be nice. More handgun bullets, definitely take that. Alright, what is this? Chemicals used for gun maintenance. It's a handgun part placed on the work desk. It can't be used in the M93R. Well, what about the Lugers? Nope, okay. All right, so there's nothing we can do right now. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It looks like there's like a picture of a Magnum right there. So this must be like a Magnum upgrade. Maybe. Maybe not. All right, so... Let's see. Let's try this key card. Does this work? No need to use it right now, okay? Uh, so, I think that's everything. There's another door in that other room, but I think it's blocked by crates. So, I don't think there, we can really do anything here. So, I guess I might as well pick up this grenade ammo because... There's nothing else I can grab. Now, let's, uh, what do we have in our inventory? So we have the gold Lugers. So we can put those in that thing, that door in the palace. We have the special eagle plate. Ashford's family crest and eagle grass with gold Albert. The indigo blue plate portion appears to be made of a special alloy. Medicine that is used to stop bleeding. It should be used on someone who is wounded. Alright, so we have the gold lugers, which means we can get in that door. We have the eagle plate, which means we can get into another door. And the hemostatic medicine, which we need to go give to that one guy. So I guess we'll uh, head that way. Maybe we should go to the palace first, just because it's closest. So I think I'll do that. And then, of course, there's the elevator here. 
that can take us up. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. This can take us up another floor. So I wonder if there's something up there that we have not seen yet. Maybe it's worth exploring. Let's, uh, let's go to 2F real quick. See if there's any. Well, I mean, obviously we can't carry anything. Unless there's an item box up here. Because that save room that we just were in did not have an item box. Can we use the card here? No use. Or no need to use it now. What does this lead to? Oh, is this where we fell through the floor? Okay. So there's nothing we can do up here right now. Until we get another key card, I guess. I think our best bet is to head to the palace just because the Lugers take up two item slots and we don't really need that right now. I'd like to free up some item space. So let's do that. Where the hell am I? Okay, that's the save room. And then this is oh, this looks exact. This layout looks exactly like the second floor. So I was confused there for a second. I was like, How, "Didn't we just come from here?" All right, Steve's still struggling to find himself. So we're just gonna go out this way. And then I guess we're gonna have to f work our way past this giant worm thing again. Unlock the door. Unless he's not here anymore. Which maybe is a possibility. Nope, he's still here. He's still here. We're getting out. Actually. No, 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 no. Okay, we're leaving. Okay. I was I was going to use the key card there, but uh, uh yeah, not worth it. All right, let's go do this Lugers real quick. Oh my god, there's two of them. Are these enemies going to be a freaking normal occurrence now? Please, no. And the good thing is that this room is right off of a save room. Yeah, that's not going to hit him. He shouldn't be able to reach me from here, though. He's dead. Are you dead, too? No. Should be dead now. That one guy's up the stairs here. If I go up the stairs, am I just going to get chewed on as soon as I get up there? Hopefully not. Maybe if I can hurry up and like go this way. He's dead. I think. I can't see the blood because of the freaking... Oh, God. I can't see the blood because the... um. Oh no, get off me. The floor blends in. Alright, what's our health like? We're on caution, but not like awful. Let's go ahead and put this in here. Put this in here. No, in there, yeah. Um... We can take this green herb out, and then I think we have a red herb in here too, so we'll take those both out and combine them. Combine that, yes. 
And then I saw more ink ribbons, so I kind of I kind of just want to organize all this real quick. Oops, there's two more. We got a crap ton of ink ribbons, so that's good in case we need to save anytime soon. We still have the submachine guns. Derulum men case. Oh, we needed a simple lock, didn't we, to get that open? Or, I mean, a lock pick. Alright, so let's reload that and let's go put these Lugers in this door. It looks like it leads to just a single, single room, so. Use. Alright, what's in here? Another boss battle. No, I'm just kidding. Hopefully not. The hell was that? Is that thunder? An old photo stand is placed here. It does not appear to be in use recently. Can we use our lighter on it? Nope. Okay. Worth a try. An antique music box. Let me get a look at that again. Okay, so we're going to need something for that, I guess. It looks like we can interact with something here, too, on this table. Maybe not, but it looks like it. Let's see. No, I guess I guess not. Okay, so we got a file here on the desk. Something is written on the memo. First digit left. Right. Second digit left. Third digit right. Fourth digit right, right, right. You must now reset while maneuvering. Uh, do I need to write this down? Me, <laughs> let me get a pen and paper. Where, where do I have a paper? I have a pen. Um, I had a freaking notepad. I don't know where the hell I put it. Okay, I got myself a notepad. Sorry if everything's all jacked up. If you guys can't hear me correctly because I'm not sitting down just yet. There we go. Alright, so we got first digit left, right. Left, right. Second. Second digit is left. Third is right. Fourth. Fourth is right, right, right. And then, you must now reset while we're maneuvering. I don't know what that means, but okay. Alright, well I got it all written down, so here we go. We're going to attempt to try this. I, I don't know if this is because of the computer or something. Turn the computer on? Sure. What the hell? The same video? So creepy. Okay, so the music box. Here we go. Please enter the password. Um, first digit. Is this it? First digit left. Right. Left. Right. Right, right, right. That, there's no way that's it. 
Yeah, I was about to say. There's no way. So is there something over here maybe we can mess with? Push the button. Okay, here we go. Left. Right. So that's one. We got a one here. One. Okay. Um, left. One nine. Uh, right. Seven. Right, right, right. 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 One. One nine seven one. And then it says reset. Hopefully this is correct. One nine seven one. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. Ooh, secret passageway. Oh shit. I really don't want to fight you unless I absolutely have to. So what's in here? It's a door. Who could have guessed? Not me, actually, because it looks like there was no other pathway. Oh, God. This looks like it's leading up to a boss battle, and I really don't want to fight a boss just yet. This game has so many paths it looks like you can take early. What the hell? Is, it, is he still going to be in here? Yeah, he's still here. All right, so we're going to go... We're going to go give that guy the hemostatic medicine before we go any further because I don't want to mess up my chance to do that. Because it looks like if we keep going that way, then... Uh, we might, we might not get a second chance of coming back, so. Although I could be completely wrong, and we could be doing the exact opposite right now, and going the way that we're, we shouldn't be going. Hopefully the zombies did not all respawn. Well, there's these guys again. I forgot about that. Nice. Two hits. Love it. Three hits. I'm in danger now. I'm going to die right here. Actually, I should have healed. There we go. I have a heal. It's a full heal, too, so. Two stretchy arm guys is not fun. I wonder if they take less damage than the other one, though, just because of the, the boss factor, you know? Is it worth risking though? I don't know. Maybe. All right, so we're gonna go in this way. Give that guy some medicine. Hopefully he's not dead by now. That would really suck. Okay, okay. Got some zombos. More zombos. Haven't I killed you guys like 15 times now? You guys in this freaking area? Probably be using the bow gun on these guys because the pistol's a little bit better, I think. But it is what it is. I'll switch to it on the way out of here. All right, buddy, I got your medicine. We're here to save you.
What are you doing here? Hemostatic medicine. How kind of you. Thanks. It's no big here, deal. Let me help you with that. You let us out. But I can take care of myself. Just go. Keep it. It was a gift from my brother, but... Thanks. Here, let me give you this in return. You might need it later on. Oh, is that a lockpick? Don't worry about me. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! We got ourselves a lock a picko, which means that we can open a few doors. Well, one door and one um, briefcase, I think. That's good news. All right, now let's go to that room with the blue emblem and see if that leads to anywhere. Okay, he's dead. Nice. These guys did not respawn again. Which, I don't, see, I don't know when the zombies respawn, or if they do respawn, or if it's just, like, a different encounter or something. No, he's still not dead. I don't think I need to kill the other guy, so I'm just going to leave him for now. Uh, we want to go this way. See, yeah, they, they must respawn. Unless, like, they just... Well, we'll know for sure if I look into the garage and there's more zombies there. Yeah. Uh, maybe they don't. Maybe what happened here is, like, they know that we have the special emblem, the eagle plate. So they're like, let's spawn a few zombies there to make it more difficult for them to get to back to where they need to go. Oh, shit. Yeah, right. What a joke! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> they really aren't that difficult. <laughs> Thank God. Once you get that gun, the guns. Um. Well, I was trying to blow up the freaking tank, but I guess. I guess that's not gonna happen. Well, since I'm not going to be able to blow up the... T Actually, now nah, I probably can. There we go. They should be dead. Equip the bow gun again. Let's see, what's, what is this way? We got, we got two doors here. We got a gate over there. And we have like a little door over here that leads looks like it leads into like a shack or something. I guess we'll go in this door first. Well, we got another zombie on the bed right there. Some handgun ammo. Which I will definitely take. First aid kit. Take that for sure. Got ourselves. It appears that he has been anatomized, anatomized. Never seen that word in my life. We got a body bag here. Body bag has been left here. 
Okay, that leads to a door, and this leads to where? A file. And not... And a, I can't I can't say words. Anatomize. Anatomists. Ant, anatomist note. There's a demon in my mind. I can't control the fierce impulses that the demon sometimes drives me to act upon. It is a brutal ceremony with the demon next to me. With the demon next to me, I enjoy watching people agonize in pain, screaming and convulsing repeatedly as they die. But Sir Alfred was kind enough to acknowledge me and has given me the facilities, chemicals, and equipment necessary to study everything. I must never betray Sir Alfred's kindness. It is especially critical that no one discovers a sacred place that only he and I know about. I swear the basement of the med this medical building will be kept secret. Of course, I keep the key to the sacred place with me at all times. Even if an outsider sees it, they will never be able to tell what it is the key. What is the key? I must remember that my life ends when I lose Sir Alfred's trust. Well, okay, so then I'm an eye is missing. So, let me guess, we're going to need an eye. Oh, what was that all about? There he is. He's donezo. I do like the bow gun, to be honest. It's pretty fun. I hope I'm not, like, wasting too much ammo with this thing. We have 38 shots left with it. Let's switch to the pistol for now. What do we got over here? More handgun ammo. Definitely take that. And what is over here? Some briefcase. Take the Durlum case. Well, you know, uh, we have lockpicks now. So let's... Uh, should be able to combine that with this, right? Check. Check. Secure by a simple lock. Use the lockpick. Yes. Whoa! An enhancement part for the M39 was inside. Or not M93. Sorry. Can we combine that here? Hell yeah! Okay, so what did that do? Burst fire. Can be adjusted to fire three succession. Three rounds in succession. Oh, so you can change it to... Okay, that's good for bosses. We will not use that, though, unless we need to for bosses. So, that, that, I guess that means maybe in the other Duralum case, there's also another upgrade. Possibly. Well, it was worthwhile coming in here just for that. Oh, God. Here we go. Is this the reason they gave it to us? Is something going to bust through the door or something? Oh, shit. Alright, well, it's definitely his eye that's all jacked up. Okay, there's two zombies. He's, he's fast. But is he fast enough? Oh, he is like a boss zombie. That's weird. That's so weird. We only have three Pogun ammo left. I guess that's fine. 100% was a boss zombie. Alright, so we got the glass eye. Let's go ahead and put that in here. Wait, what is this little, like... There's like a little picture. Oh, it's a picture. Okay. It's, I thought it was like, maybe like a key card or something. Let's see. Ooh. 
Unlock the basement. What could be inside the basement? Guess we'll see. Bats. Gotta be slow. Move slowly, Claire. We're on 30 minutes, so I hope the Elgato doesn't bug out. But if it does, uh, you guys know what's going on. Okay, the bats are freaked out, so I'm going to go back upstairs because I accidentally ran right there and then come back down. Do not run. I'm going to mark on this notebook that I finished that. It sounds like they're still geeking out, so hopefully they're not, though. Nope, they're, they're up there sleeping. That's good. They need to stay their asses asleep. Well, we're in a new area. I don't really want to have it on full auto. There we go. I think, I think full auto is fine if you're fighting bosses. But you don't really want it on full auto if you're not. Gosh darn it. I hate when they drop right in front of you and just automatically grab your foot. You dunzo? Good. More bow gun ammo. Definitely take that. And handgun ammo too. And then, like this damn torture chamber, what the hell is going on in here? Strange devices are on display here, okay. I wonder what this weird device is used for. It appears to be an old water mill. Okay, um, do we somehow need to get the water running or something? Thick curtain has been dropped dropped down. Um, can we sit in this chair? Somebody was enjoying themselves here. We're gonna have another boss zombie? <laughs> Maybe. No, but it looks like we have a puzzle. Puzzle of some kind with a shield. Um, looks like there's three vents on the ground. I'm just trying to take this in before. The stone statue is holding a helmet. Okay. Stone statue is holding a shield. Holding some armor. Holding a rusted sword. Take the rusted sword. For now, sure. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. So I guess I got to hurry up and, like, move this thing. Hopefully. Well, okay, that wasn't too bad. Thought that might be a little bit more difficult than that, but uh, I'll take it. Oh shit! <laughs> I was not expecting that. Is he dead? Yeah, I was gonna say no way. Should... Are you serious? Is he another boss on me? Nope. What is this? A scroll? Take the piano roll. Uh. Let's check that. What is that supposed to be for? Roll paper that is used to play it for an autoplay piano. If you have set it, the music on the paper will be played. I have no idea where a damn piano is. 
don't think we I don't think we've come across a piano yet. To be honest. All right, so for now, I think that's all we can do in here. So let's let's leave. I need to find a save point before this Elkato decides to crash. Oh shit. Forgot there are bats in here. Run, Claire! I do have an herb and a first aid kit though, in case things get dire. Alright, let's let's leave this place. I wanna check on my health set. Still on yellow, so it's not bad. I still haven't figured out what the damn reload button is. Oh, there's an herb right there I never even saw. It's really hard to make out. <laughs> the game's so dark, I can't really see it. Well, now I know why they gave you two tanks. Because they spawned more enemies here. I don't want to. I don't want to uh, combine those green herbs just in case we come across a red herb. All right, can we go in here? Keep out. That's always uh, a welcome sign to see. Well, there's something right here, hidden. Hidden by the camera angle. Um, I can hop up here, but there's nothing to see. Is that an item box just chilling? Okay. Uh, let's put the first aid kit in here. Oops, I don't need that, I don't think. Um, I think we should keep everything else for now, just, just in case. Is there anything we should take out, though? Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah this, 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 this. Definitely want to check that out. What's inside? Oh, it's just bow gun powder. Okay. Well, we'll we'll create some. Uh... Oh, there's a door here. That's clever, cleverly uh, hidden. We'll definitely create some bow gun, like gunpowder arrows or whatever. This leads back to a save room, I think. I think I just saw that. Oh, interesting. Okay, this is how we get our items out of here. Shit. Well. How about, how about no? Not anymore. Not anymore, you bitch robot. Ain't no damn way. Alright, so now we can take everything out of here. We're going to... I guess we can combine these. Just to get another slot. We definitely want to take everything with us. So, only because of that will I, am I going to heal right here. Because we're going to get a first aid kit anyway. Which is better than uh, two green herbs. So, and then we're going to save right here. And I guess we'll end the episode. So, I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you for hanging out with me. And until the next episode... I'll see you guys later. Peace out.